When I was a kid, an Easter tradition was to hollow out eggs by putting a small hole in the top and the bottom and then blowing the contents out like this. But man, that is hard. So I thought a vacuum cleaner should be able to suck those contents out without effort. Just putting them on the end of the hose like this should work, but then all the goo ends up in my wife's meal and vacuum cleaner, so I'll have to catch the uh, contents somehow else. And I'll try to catch the contents in this sturdy uh, applesauce jar. So the egg's gonna go on here. I just need a hole in the top. And maybe make that a little bit bigger. And that way the egg contents go in here, but I need to suck the air out of this jar. So I'll put a hole in the side. Several actually. Just gonna make these a little bit bigger. Now I need to seal this on here and for that I'll attempt to use duct tape. The problem is this duct tape doesn't stick too well to the plastic here so I'm just gonna need one more wrap around right here just to hold it in place. Okay, got the hose kind of secured with a chair hooked up to the vacuum cleaner. So now we'll see if this is going to be a fail video or not. Oh, I'll add this thing in here just to make sure we don't end up sucking the egg into the vacuum cleaner. Oh no, cracked it. Oh well, keep going. And it's a hollow egg. It works. This tool was just a little bit too pointy, so it cracked the shell when I kind of pushed it in. So let's try something else. Okay. Top hole. So this is a very small hole. You wouldn't blow through that small a hole. But I think the vacuum will do fine. Another very, very hollow egg. And I guess we'll be making some omelets too. I should add that this uh, plastic shield here was really necessary because when I took the egg off with the vacuum running, the air jet into it really splattered that egg around, but uh, none of it behind here, so the vacuum was safe. <laughs> 